What's going on, y'all? How you doing? I'm out here by the camper. It's warming up. Getting a little better to where I can uh, do more to it. See, I got the single door here. And there's a 300-pound door lift. And I've got another one over here. And this whole from here to here is a whole big door and it opens up see i've got hinges up here along the top to where the whole thing will stand out like that when it's warm and all that that's what i do but when it's raining and cold we can use the little door what but we're gonna have a toilet in here i'm gonna have a little spot out here to where i can have a shower curtain around and have an outside shower you know solar bag and and all and uh gonna have extra water and you can see my one two three four six by nines you know and i'm gonna have some other stereo speakers and all that around here and uh i'm gonna have some places after it's put on the back of the truck then i can finish selling it up and being doing it all because i'm going to cut the back of the cab out and the front of the bed of the truck and open it up like it's a suburban so we won't ever have to go out to get back here or up there you see what i mean so but i just wanted to show you all a little bit what's going on you know i got quite a bit of work to do to it still so and uh weather has been one of the biggest problems epoxy doesn't want to cure you know in 30 40 degree weather it helps to keep it around 70 and up so we got the fiber here oh yeah i told you i was got i got some uh stuff that i'm putting together for gear and all because i go camping and we do some other things we used to go on some hog hunts when when it was permissible but yeah, it's other things. So I've got some other gear that I'm going to be showing you. This is the fiber that goes on the camper. See, you can see a little bit right there that I still have to put the uh, epoxy on. But all the way out and around, you can see where the fiber, I've already got it across the top where it stops right there. You know, that's just the same with the plywood. So, and then the front, you know the nose of it still got to do the epoxy under here and finish all that i need to wrap this so you can see this has got fiber on it already all this all along the top all the way down down both sides so i'll show you something else check this out this is pretty cool this is called it's not plexiglass but it's a uh it's a lexan you see how thick that stuff is? That's what they uh, use on the windshields of NASCARs and all that. And even when it's thicker, they use it on the windshield and stuff of the uh, space shuttle and things, you know, from what I understand. It's a little bit more tempered, but that's kind of like the stuff that it is, you know. So, I've got quite a bit of things that i'm getting wrapped up i didn't want to talk y'all out too much but i wanted to show you about the camper and all oh yeah and i got the the epoxy table the giveaway i'm still doing that youtube has screwed with me so many times man i've had to redo things or what but i'm still doing that okay here's one of them and i gotta i sanded it down and i'm about to put the final clear coat on it and then all of this is metal flake it has uh tiny little spots of uh metal kind of flake in it to where if it hits the sun it it's bright it's very bright so matter of fact let's see well, i don't know where it's at oh there it is here's one i'm gonna redo this one too let me show you Can you see that? See that's metal flake and all that? Well, that's how that red is. So, yeah, pretty cool, huh? But this one here is going to be the same thing. I have to, I need to sand it down and then put another 
finished clear coat on the top of it and you can see how it's just sparkling oh yeah but the red one's the same way i've got a uh i've got other videos if you look down uh on the video line that i have there are there's all these pictures of these and stuff there they, they just had a couple of imperfections in them and i wanted to straighten them up and uh the weather hit and just screwed everything up <clears throat> it's kind of hard to keep my garage warm when i need it up around 70 and above and we're having these giant temperature swings down to 30 and you know it's it's crazy so but i just want to show you all some things you know the the fiber that's on the on the camper you know like what i was talking about i've got some other things some other videos that i'm going to be doing i've uh maybe i'll have some help to when i'm building the legs and when i'm welding them and all that i'll be able to show uh, a little bit on how i do that as well so it's everything's just been crazy and i people have been asking me some questions about what i think about this what i think about that you know and i talk to them a little bit and i tell them one thing too that i want everybody to understand and please practice this put your phones down turn your tv off tell all your kids to stop playing the games turn their phones off and y'all sit around and talk sit around and talk go for a walk play a board game monopoly or something checkers battleship whatever man i tell people turn your tv off what's any different nothing going to home depot walmart lowe's whatever run into white folks black folks chinese indian mexican uh, you know and everybody's just as polite as can be so go for a walk y'all do you see what i do i get out my garage and i'm like forget that poison box yeah i don't i don't sit around and watch all the bs and over their echo chamber as old brian stelter used to put it so turn your tv off turn the games off turn all the electronics off and sit around and talk with your family go do something go to the park have a cookout do something get away from that tv get out and about and see what's happening like what i'm doing get out here and enjoy the sun listen to the birds chirp yep enjoy your time y'all there's more people out there that don't know nothing and those are the ones that are just ready to run around like chickens with their heads cut off so relax take it easy i'm still watching things but i'm not going to keep on yapping at you and telling you things that we already know so that's why i am getting back at it getting back at it man it's warm thank you the lord <laughs> so i appreciate it i appreciate all the likes all the shares and stuff like that we just gotta hang together y'all we got to hang together we yeah we you know our country needs us our kids need us our generations need us don't be scared to speak up don't be scared to speak up so like I say, I've got a bunch more stuff coming up. Y'all hang tight with me. I appreciate y'all. Love y'all too. Thank you very much. I try to comment and get back to y'all as soon as I can. But like, I've got a lot of stuff going on. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll be in touch, all right? Peace.